So guys, everything came up to 1,000 rupees yeah. for the soap. This is what a thousand rupees look like here in the beautiful country of Sri Lanka. Yeah. How much for the incense? That one is thousand rupees. That's a thousand as well. So a thousand rupees. It's made of natural flowers. Mm. Oh, okay. So he's doing beef and chicken roti. Sorry. <laughs> he's doing beef and chicken roti here. So you can see he's putting it, taking the beef from there, and then he'll put it. Give a bit extra hello, how are you? Say that again. You fix shoes? Yeah. Okay, okay. Big state man, Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All, uh, all right. So these, I've just walked in and they stopped me, guys. They they fixed the shoes here in Nigambo. Yeah, my, my shoes are okay for now. Yeah, 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 for now. But if it's, it's bad, I will come back again. What's your name? Yeah, Ramzan. I'm Ramzan? Yeah. And you, sir? Basmi. Basmi. Okay. That from Nigeria? No, no, uh, England. England? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I came here for holiday in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You speak, uh, Sin yeah, you speak Sinhalese? Yeah. Sinhalese? Are you born? Ah, I'm born. Oh, you're yeah, born. Uh, Hyundai, Hyundai. Hyundai. Yeah, I say, li li I know a little bit, a few words. Yeah. So this is it, guys. If you ever want your shoe fix here, this is how it is in Igambo. Okay, bye. Bye. All right. So they do a uh, shoe repair. They was asking me if I want my shoe repaired. So uh, this is like a herbal shop here. Okay, maybe I'll I'll walk in and have a look. Very interesting. You know, in Sri Lanka, they practice um, Ayurveda. You know, it's a, they use a lot of herbs in their medicine. So these are all cough syrup and everything like that. Okay. Hello. How are you, sir? All right, someone come and talk to me soon. Yes, yeah, so I'm in the store. I'm going to check it out. How are you? Are you okay? Are you born? Huh? Are, are you born? Are you born? Yeah, where are you Hyundai. Okay, that's good. A few words, you know, I'm asking how he's doing. My friend, I'm looking for um, soap for how to have a shower. Which is the good one you have? Yeah. So I'm just checking out, uh, I need to get a soap to have a shower. Oh wow, it's really nice one. It's really nice guys, look at this. Turmeric. We also got cinnamon, lovely. And this one is from Bee Honey, so really nice soap. How much is this one for my friend? This one, 500. 500, for one or for all of this? For one, huh? Oh wow. 500. You can give me a good price. A 500 last price. You can't do for 300. Oh, it's fixed price. <laughs> no, no, no negotiate. Uh, no, no, you say no negotiation here, guys. Okay. Doesn't matter, um, I'll take two. So, let me get these two. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So I've got in the cinnamon and honey one. They also do rose water here as well. All right. Yeah, that's it, yeah, that's it for today. Just needed a soap. Yes. Yeah, I'm a YouTuber. I, I travel around the world. Do you watch YouTube? 
my channel. Let me give you my card. My channel, you can subscribe on there. You'll see this video. How are you doing today, sir? You alright? You okay? Alright. So guys, everything came up to 1,000 rupees yeah. for the soap. This is what 1,000 rupees look like here in the beautiful country of Sri Lanka. You are from? From okay. England. England. Yeah, I'm here on holiday. Ah. Yeah, I travel around the world. I do YouTube videos. How are you, sir? Yeah. So subscribe. I'll see you. Huh? Have a good day, guys. Thank you so much. Or should I say in Sinhalese, Estuti. Estuti. All right. All right. All right. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> I'm too tall. <laughs> yeah. So that's it. Got myself some soap. It's 500 rupees. And they really do a lot of natural stuff here, man. Like cinnamon soap, they have bee, honey, they have turmeric, soap made from turmeric. So that's really nice, man. So if you're looking for that real natural stuff, you can find all of that here in Nigambo. That's a policeman on his motorbike. It's what the police dress like here in Sri Lanka. They wear brown uniform. That's what the police wear. It's quite chill, you know. Wow, you got clothes made from certain fabrics. Really nice. Have to check that out next time. Let's let's explore more. So this is Main Street here in Negambo. Really nice, you know. Really nice here. Further down you'll find other places, but let's go this way. Sorry. How are you my friend? Hello, yeah, how are you? Yeah. Police are chill, you know. Some places you're filming and you say hello to the police, they might pull you over, but so far these ones have been quite chill. Hello, my friend. How are you? You okay? Yeah, my, huh? Inspire for Travel, my YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is your business? Yes. What, what do you do here, sir? This cleaning. Cleaning? Oh, okay, what, what what do you clean? <coughs> oh, okay, gold. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay, yeah. So you'll find a lot of that here. You can come and get gold, and you do silver as well. Clean yeah. silver, and so. Oh, that's good. I'm I'm from England. I'm here on holiday, visiting Sri Lanka. This is my YouTube channel, Inspire for Travel. Yeah, yeah. You watch YouTube? Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka is a lovely country so far. Um, people are very friendly. And I, I've only been here about two days now. Yeah, yeah. I should be here for about a month. And then, yeah, I'll travel again. No, I haven't been there as yet. Yeah, I would like to visit. There's a tea plantation there, Buddhist temple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you from Kandy? Yeah, are, are you from Kandy? 
Oh, that's nice. I'll be, I will definitely visit there. It's a lovely place. Well, nice meeting you guys. Have a good day. And as they say in Sri Lanka, it's good to Yes. Thank you. Thank you. All right, bye. Yeah, so that was, that was nice. They are jewelers, so they clean jewelry, gold, silver. They also um, sell um, gold jewelry as well. And the guy was saying he's from Candy. That's a place I have to visit. It's like, um, has a lot of um, tea plantations there, Buddhist temples and stuff like that. So we'll definitely check it out to see how it's like in Candy. So, so far what I'm seeing here has a lot of jewelers. All along the, the road here, I'm seeing jewelers guys. So that's interesting. battery is running a bit low so I'm gonna switch cameras in a minute whoa okay so this is like a canal here where you can tour here yeah okay yeah you can tour here and tour the canal it goes right up I believe to Colombo so you can actually get a ride here so wow. I might check that out a church a very big church it's called st. Mary's Church this is what it looks like Wow this is the outside of the church not sure if I could go in but this is what it looks like this is a very um, I guess iconic building here in Nigamba <clears throat> many people here are Christians some are Buddhists but what you find, especially in coastal towns like Nigambo, Gal, these different places in Sri Lanka, a lot of people was influenced by the Portuguese and stuff like that. So you will find a lot of people are Christians. You have people with a surname like Fernando and all of these type of Portuguese names. So that's interesting. Are you born? Uh, I'm just walking around. How are you? I'm fine. Yes. Just a prison now there. Okay. A prison. Hotel, that's the beach side, down the beach side. Oh, that's the beach, beach side. Oh, straight down. Oh, yeah. To Nigambo Beach. Oh, uh, Beach. This one here. Uh, yeah, the one on the left side. Oh, straight down on left. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you so much, my friend. It's Tuti. Okay. You are so you hungry? Yeah. Let me see. Yeah, we stay one lunch packet. Yeah, yeah. Good place for you, sir. Yeah, yeah. No problem. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's give a little something, you know. I yeah, yeah you did. <laughs> uh, one second, guys. All right, guys. Seems like school's over. Our school today. From school, from school. All right. So these are all school children. And I believe it's a, a school that may be connected to that church where we just were after speaking to those guys. That's a restaurant over there. We might check that out later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. Hello, how are you? All right. So these are all children from school. Gotta be careful on these streets. Very busy here. Very, very busy. All right. Yeah, these are all from school. There's a school here. All right. Hello, how are you? Fine, fine. All right. So this is it here, guys. St. Mary's College. Our school today. It's okay? You like it? All right. That's good. So they're from school. Wa alaikum salam. All right. 
Hello, hello. Are you, are, you, are you gonna say hello to the vlog? It's on YouTube. Yeah. Are you going that way? <laughs> All right. Some people are saying hello. So yeah, this is um, Saint Mary's College. So that church where we just where we just were, that is the school that's connected to it. It seems to be a boys' school, all boys. So yeah, that's it. <laughs> So yeah, as we walk on, I, I believe from here, it gets much more quieter. We, where we were was much more busy. And that is the more lively and more business area here in Nagambo, that's Main Street. This street seems to be leaving me to, leading me to more residential areas where people live and other buildings. So I'm gonna walk back up, might try to get something to eat. And um, hello, how are you? Yeah, so I'm gonna walk back up, try to get something to eat, and we'll see what's on offer here in Nigambo. Bishop. All right, guys, so I literally just walked in this shop here and um, they have some amazing beadwork here, all made from she shells. And it's, yeah, so it's really nice, very affordable as well. So these are all the ones you'll see, very common throughout Sri Lanka. So this is what you expect to see when you come to Nigambo. So if you're ever in Nigambo, they gave me a business card. The name of the shop is Aldi Mini ha ha Hands Craft, and they do all kinds of gift wholesale and retail so that would be, that's very interesting they even also got these flutes here look at this guys look at these flutes 4450 rupees see so these are all the things you expect to see if you're ever in the nigambo area you can definitely buy these ones here so all local incense now for those who don't know this is citronella Citronella is very good for mosquitoes as well. So if you're ever having problem with mosquitoes and stuff, you can actually burn this in your house. How much for the incense? That one is thousand rupees. That's a thousand as well. So a thousand rupees. It's made of natural flowers. Natural flowers. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So this one is made from natural flowers. Made from local community. And okay. In village. In villages, yeah. All right, so they're made from the local community in the villages. So yeah, definitely check out Aldi Mini Hats and Crafts here in Nigambo, Main Street. All right, so what I can say, this Nigambo Main Street is really big. I know a lot of people when they come to Sri Lanka, they may miss this street but if you really want to meet the local people and get a local vibe you can come here and then there's also a beach side as well around here that, that we're going to be checking out so you can check out that as well if you come to N Nigambo so yeah the beaches are not as nice as other beaches in the south but for what it's worth if you just want to see what a beach on this side is like you can certainly check it out here so we're walking down to the square here seem to be a figurine there i don't know if that's supposed to be a representative of a religious person and or something like that so we will see many many jewelers around here and another thing you'll notice with some of the jewelers some of them do currency conversion so if you have us dollars or pounds or euros they could change it to the local currency of um what's it called uh rupees I mean, let's see here. What's this shop? Oh, these are all like alcohol beverages here. How are you doing, my sir? Friend, you okay? You do Sri Lankan Arak. How much is the Arak? 
Which arak do you want? Because we have, we have a lot You of have different arak. We have varieties here. Yeah, Which is the one that's made in Sri Lanka? It's all from Sri Lanka. Oh. You don't have anything from the foreign country. It's oh. all Sri Lanka. Oh, these are all Sri Lanka. And yeah. how much is it? Which the prices, like the old arak. How much is the old arak? This one? Yeah. This one, this one, and this we have another old. This one, this one is old. This. Okay. This is a company, this is a nice company. How much is it? Price. So this is uh, drinks that's made locally here in Sri Lanka. How are you, sir? How are you, boy? Where are you, Kahamada? Andai. Andai. All right. Yeah, so they do local drinks here. That's interesting. Let's see how much the price is. I just want to check the price. This one, 3,005. 3,005, yeah? This is old Arak. Oh, old Arak. Right. That's a nice one. Right. Good, best company. All oh, right. So this is supposed to be one of the best quality drinks and it's made from coconut, coconut yes. so this is coconut arrack guys so that's something which is locally produced here but for some people if you're not into alcohol stay away it's around 33.5 percent but it's from coconut so yeah that's really interesting to see some of the local things that is produced here in sri lanka there's a lot of companies Eric make company. Oh, a lot of them, huh? But this is one this of is the best. best. Yeah, one of the best. Okay, okay all right then. Well, thank you for showing me, my friend. Yeah. I'm just walking around for now, yeah? Okay, thank you. All right. So that's something I see they really produce locally. A lot of people that I've met are... They don't really drink like that. They fear this, the Arak. <laughs> so that's interesting. <laughs> no, no. So that's interesting. So we're at the square here in Sri Lanka. At the square, you know. And we're just walking around. Gotta be careful with the traffic here. Cars. So these are all areas where people come and do shopping here. You don't see much of this here in Sri Lanka, but people do sell um clothes on the ground like what we're seeing but it's not as popular as what you will see maybe like in Kenya and different places wow these are nice clocks and stuff This is Nigombo. Welcome to Nigombo, Sri Lanka. We're exploring, that's right. Let me know what you, you thought of Nigombo so far. For me, it's really big and there's always something going on. Even down this side, I haven't been that side, but you can get clothes. Let's see what's going on here. So they sell clothes on this side and hats and everything like that, you know? And these are all bags you can buy here sometimes you might might need a rack sack so it's good to know that you can come to an area and purchase it how you doing you okay all right are you born all right the old clothes here in this side of the market and tuk tuk comes through here as well my friend what's the name of this market What's the name of this market? Are you born? The name of this market? Yeah, here. The name, what's it called? Daily Fair. Daily Fair. Oh, thank you. It's good thing. All right. So, so this is called Daily Fair Market. And uh, this is what you can get here at the Daily Fair. Close. How are you, my friend? All right, all right. All right, Daily Fair Market. How are you, sir? I'm okay. You doing wudu? You doing wudu? Are you Muslim? Oh, I thought you were doing uh, wudu to pray. <laughs> All right. The way he's washing himself, is, I thought he was about to go pray, you know? So, yeah, this is the shops. Yeah, in Daily Fair, and it's, it has an inside as well. Hello, how are you, sir? Fine, fine, fine. You're right. Where are you from? I'm England. England? Yeah. Oh, very nice country. Yeah, it's nice. Sri Lanka is also. Where are you going now? I'm just walking around the oh, market, okay. my brother. Are you playing football? 
I play football. I like football. Yes. I know that. You know. Which which team do you support? Uh, it's a Sri Lankan team, the Federation. Oh, oh, Sri Lankan team. But yeah. what about in the Premier League? Premier League also England's Premier League. Yeah. Which one do you support? Uh, Barcelona. Oh, he's Barcelona, but Barcelona is Spain. Spain. <laughs> yeah, yes. yeah. What about Manchester United, Manchester United, Arsenal? No, other than Liverpool. Oh, Liverpool. Oh, uh, what? Salah. Uh, Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah. Yeah. Okay, we got someone from uh, who supports Liverpool here. That's Liverpool, that's. Liverpool. Mohamed Salah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I support Tottenham. Best and, um, player. Best player. He's cool player. You know? Yeah, yeah. He's he's a good player yeah. indeed. Are, are you are you Muslim? I'm a, yes, I'm Muslim as a player. Okay, all right. Assalamu alaikum. I can see, I can see from your bed. <laughs> all right. right. Have a good day. Yes, are you sir? Right. All right. I'm okay. How are you? I'm fine. Uh, this is your business? Yeah, also. What are you selling? We have the uh, sarum and oh, okay. bedsheet, towel, oh, etc. Right. Okay, okay. So he's selling sar sarums and towels. I like that one. Oh, right. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm just looking. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm just looking for now. But um, if... 100% cotton. Uh, real cotton? Cotton. Okay. Also, guys, 100% cotton here. Yeah, many colors and many, yeah. many items. Okay, nice. All right. Yeah guys, right now I'm in the local hotel here. Uh, I got invited just to come and see what the local hotel is like. So this is it here. This is at the daily market here in Nigambo. This is what the hotel is like. They're playing their music. And uh, you can see what they're selling here. They have chapatis. They have uh, roti. They have samosa. This is also cake. A cake. Yeah, that one is cake. So this you can all get here at the uh, daily market here in Negambo. Let me show you what this looks like. Yeah, so this is the hotel here. Can I see? Can I see? Beef roti. Oh, beef roti. So, oh, okay, so he's doing beef and chicken roti, sorry. <laughs> he's doing beef and chicken roti here, so you can see he's putting it, taking the beef from there, and then he'll put it here. Oh, that beef, huh? Chicken. chicken and he rolls it up this is how he rolls it to make a, this is patty or samosa so it's like a samosa he's doing this is the guy here this is what he's doing pressing it down spinning it like that get the chicken from here all right Thank you, yeah, so this is, how are you, you alright? Okay. Yeah, how are you sir? Alright, is that your boss? Okay. He speaks Tamil? Oh, Tamil, Vanakam, Vanakam. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, how much is a 7-Up? 7-Up? Yeah. Huh? Yeah, can I have a 7-Up? Yeah, 7-Up. 